time for the visit with the person of high strangeness. By looking at that opening shot, I could see your cup of coffee was almost empty. So how about you just refill your coffee? Because today we're going to go, um, uh, we're going to go to Germany and enjoy autumn a little bit. Now earlier, actually last year in 2003, CK, our international reporter, came, and she had brought footage from castles. Um, Neuschwanstein to be exact, and a lot of people liked that because during their military tours and vacations they had been to some of these places and they appreciated the fact that it was uh, filmed in real time. Real time means you're going to look at it exactly the way they look at it, and so it gives you the impression that you're actually following along and stumbling and, and that type of thing. So CK had brought all this footage and um, she and then we had to have it translated from PAL, and so constantly you had this waving in the bottom there. So what we did is we sent her home to Germany with an American camera. And because of that, uh, the footage is so excellent today. The color is great, everything is great. And um, so the other day she sent the footage, and so without any further delay, as soon as we queue it up, the first place CK has taken us to is a place called Bamberg. It's a little town in Germany where uh, she went to visit uh, someone here recently and she thought there was wonderful things and treasures that you might enjoy. And while we're queuing up here, if any of you are anywhere else and want to send footage, we'll turn it into something just wonderful. And so we're going to go to Bamberg, Germany so for right I'm now. Standing now and uh, and I'm just really excited. So, Bamberg, Germany, here this we go. church was built at 690. See that? Looks cool, huh? <laughs> The city Bamberg is a town in Bavaria, Bavaria land, yeah. <laughs> Bavaria, the old, old town. <laughs> it's a history city, yeah. <laughs> well, I want to try to go in and look for more pictures. CK, of course, could not talk because she was in a church. But when you look at the, the riches that and the treasures that's in this, in this dome here, it's just incredible. And she has such a fine eye for finding things um, that's not really very apparent to some of the rest of the people. So she just has a, an eye for detail there. That, of course, is all gold. There are, there are people that actually take little gold plates um, and uh, like little, look, little cookies and they have to overlay that um, in, in buildings. And uh, in fact, there's a church that the whole roof is made from gold and just like a gold layer. So a lot of work went into, into that. It's just marvelous. I didn't cut out hardly anything because I didn't want anything to get lost. A lot of cherubs and this is a very Catholic area of the country. The, the name of the church is St. Martin. I have some information from the history. 
The parish church of St. Martin was originality built on the present Maxplatz. Jesuit College and Church called to the holy name of Jesus. In 1696, laying of the foundation stone, architect was George Dinsenhofer, later his brother Leonard. Buildings, of course. Building so style is the so-called Jesuit Baroque. 1693, consecration of the altar. 1696, completion of the tower. From 1700, I'm sorry, 1773 on University Church. Stations of the Cross by Andreas Theodor Mattenheimer. Well, that's all I know. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see that water guy over there? Neptune. It's very pretty. There are a few German people hanging around here. <laughs> Here are a few houses. Notice the couple stones. They are so pretty, yeah. But in the summertime, you can sit yeah. outside and drink coffee, have fun, have a small talk and ice cream. <laughs> See, this is the name from the coffee. I don't know. Yeah. More than house. More than house. See? Cool. This is more than house, yeah. This is a midwife. Look at that house. Oh. A lot of US military still stationed in yeah, back to store. this day. Stores, German. Store. from here. I'll try to show she's trying to catch those bells for you. Mm. Yeah, yeah. The name of the show is it's Autumn in Germany. Now. This is New York. Fall. Fall. Yeah. Beautiful leaves. Called Old 
Venezia. It's a very nice town. You see that house here? Very old house. It's the old town hall. This is Alde Rathaus. The lady will have. You can drive with the ship. must be Kunigunda. Kunigunda. I don't know what that means. It's a name. Very funny. You see that here? The long ship. Oh. A lot of old houses, houses are here. See that? Yeah. Everything is so clean. That's one of the things that I noticed immediately. I mean, not one piece of paper on the so, street. it's an eagle. Yeah. It's on another house here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nicht mehr so lange da stehen, wir haben ja, nicht so laufen so. können, dann ging es schnell. Ja. The lady with her, I don't think she realized ja, we was making a movie here. <laughs> Store. Cool, yeah. It's a Latin word. A potete. Was meinst du, wie schön? Yeah. Zeitweise. What means that? Oh. Well, this place called Domeplatz. You see a dome over here? It's a another church. Ca cathedral, I think it's called. See that? Well, Bamberg is very cat Catholic, Catholic. Catholic place. So you see